morning. It is our Tuesday. It is Tuesday. We are checking out of the hotel here in New York City and we will be embarking on our cruise to Halifax, Nova Scotia. It's a four night cruise aboard Royal Caribbean. It's gonna be more of a relaxing one because there's only one port of call, two sailing days. So compared to our last few days here in New York City where we've been touring, playing tourists, running around, eating and stuffing ourselves, uh, it's gonna be a little bit more relaxing, but again, with more eating and food and all that stuff. So um, we're just checking out. Um, we have a car service picking us up to take us to New Jersey because we're boarding aboard the Cape Liberty port terminal, I believe. And uh, we are boarding the Liberty of the Seas on Royal Caribbean for our cruise. So I'm going to finish packing up here. It's been a wonderful few days here in New York City. Never enough time to do everything that you want or taste everything that you want. So we'll definitely have to be back. Um, but I will definitely be back for, for Fashion Week when I'm here for most of the time. Uh, but for now, i got to finish packing. So I'll keep you posted on our way to uh, the cruise ship or when we board. Okay. Okay, yeah, my feet are slipping. Alright, now what? How much water can it be? <laughs> I'm good. I'm up. We just checked in, it was pretty quick. Security took the longest, check-in was fast, and we went through the tunnel and are heading to the ship. Here's everybody. We're gonna do the impossible, lose weight this trip. <laughs> no dessert. We're gonna have lunch. I don't wanna starve. Oh look, my hair looks style. I haven't been on a ship in how long? It's been years. I think it was a Greece ship was our last one. That was the last one? I think so, Greece ship. so long ago. So it's a little after three o'clock. We were um, headed back to our room after wind jammers. It's a little windy, apologies. And uh, we thought sail away was 3.30, but it's sailing away already. So we wanted to go to the front of the ship because we think that's where the helipad is on deck four. We want to check it out.
are in eight, I forgot what floor, what room we're in, <laughs> but we're on the eighth floor. 8022? 8320. 8, I, I don't remember. We have four cabins with the, within the family and I'm trying to, I can't keep the room straight. So we are finally in, um, everything came in, the suitcases and all that stuff. Some of the stuff came in wet because it had a major downpour when we arrived at the port um, at Cape Liberty, New Jersey. But unpacked, here's the room. I'm gonna give you a quick room tour. I still don't know if I've been on the ship before. This is the Liberty of the Seas on Royal Caribbean. Um, it's an older ship built in the 2000s. Uh, I heard it was refurbished and changed, but the room still feels a little dated, but you know what? We'll, we'll see what it's like. Um, the staff and the crew was very nice so far. Um, let's take a look at the room, starting with the bathrooms. When you walk in, here is the bathroom. Typical stand-up shower. At least it's not a curtain. Um, they give you shampoo and body wash in there. It's a handheld shower toilet and then the sink side um, there's storage behind the glass for whatever you need and some towel racks so pretty standard room here's a look back to the entryway and then this is the uh, closet so here's the closet um, plenty of room and there's also a safe and some wire racks um, in the closet so basically that's what it is you gotta look for that and let's spin you around and then when you go into the room full length mirror there's a sofa i don't know if it's a sofa bed here's the vanity area with lots of drawers and storage behind that little thing tv nightstands and then here is the bed there's some storage underneath as well for suitcases, uh, airing out one of the suitcases because it was all wet in the rain. And then this is a room view looking back, not bad. And we have a balcony view or a balcony uh, for our room. So I can open this up. If I can ever open this up. Two nice chairs, table, plenty of space. There is the ocean going by. Here we are on the Royal Promenade. We just met up with my mom and dad and we are gonna watch the parade. That's part of the sail away festivities. I guess there's this parade, maybe it's pirate or ocean themed, which makes sense for a ship. Um, so we're going to find a spot here on the Royal Promenade and enjoy the show.
on deck eight, which is where our room is. This is the Royal Promenade down below. We just got to see the uh, Welcome Aboard parade by the staff. It was fun. <laughs> Appetizers have arrived. It's either escargot or crab cakes for the most part. Oh, Pa got spinach and artichoke dip. We got some portobello mushrooms, southern fried chicken, prime rib, portobello mushroom, and prime ribs. And I got a chicken sog with some naan. See you, Dad. Huh? Still heading to Halifax, Nova Scotia. Um, this is the first day I've actually been able to sleep in during this vacation. I actually didn't get out of bed until almost 9 a.m., which is like, wow, I slept like a baby last night. Um, wasn't, I was feeling a little, a little under the weather, like getting like, like a headache and all that stuff, and I was falling asleep. It may have to do with the fact that um, I'm wearing a little seasick patch behind my ear here. Um, and they said some of the, there could be some little side effects as I try to get used to it. So we shall see. But today's a day at sea, um, just cruising. Um, gonna meet up with the family at lunch in the main dining room at 11.30. And then I think we're gonna catch a show, the Broadway show. It is um, Saturday Night Fever, I believe it's the show. And that's gonna be, we're watching the early show at like 2.30 or something. And then go, before that we go to dinner. So today's a very relaxing day. Um, it's nice to just unwind, which is what I expected from this cruise. So that is it for this morning, and I will keep you posted on what we do next. Okay, see you in a bit. Wednesday night, it's the formal night. Um, food is okay in the main dining room. Now we're taking a little walk as we continue our sailing to Halifax, Nova Scotia. It's very foggy out here, as you can tell in the, in the background, and uh, but otherwise it's uh, smooth sailing so far. We are exploring the ship at night. I've never been to the top deck other than Windjammer. And look how foggy it is. It's like we're sailing into unknown waters. Here we are at Johnny Rockets. We're up on deck 11. We 
ended up getting a milkshake that we split for the two of us. With our platinum status, we get some coupons and also um, we have $50 onboard credit. So here it is, Oreos. <laughs> Last full day on the ship and we are checking out the flow rider and the other water rides on the back and top deck. We're gonna see who can hold their breath like on water longer. Can you? Ready? evening aboard Liberty of the Seas. Lovely dinner tonight in the main dining room. We have a little bit of time before we go see the show. Um, some acrobatic air, water performers, that should be cool. And then finish packing because tomorrow we have to catch our plane as soon as possible because we have such a small window from departure to getting on the plane. So wish us luck. Wish us luck. Wish us luck. 